Hi friends, welcome to HTL Lectures. Today I am going to teach you about demand curve. What is your demand curve? It's a curve. It's a curve showing inverse relationship between price and quantity demanded that means it's a curve here in the x-axis we represent quantity in the y-axis we represent price it shows inverse relationship that means we have already discussed the law of demand that is the inverse relationship between price and quantity when price decreases quantity demand increases when price increases quantity demand decreases so if suppose my price is p1 and my quantity is q1 and suddenly when the price is decreased from p1 to p2 my quantity demanded should decrease so should increase to q2 that means my quantity has been increased when the price is decreased this is shown in a curve or a graphical representation that is what we call the demand curve it is sloping downward it is sloping downward from where from left to right left to right this is the left side from left to right this is what the uh, demand curve shows to us and with this along with this you have to know the difference between individual demand curve demand curve and market demand curve individual demand curve means demand curve of a single person and market demand means demand curve of all person in the market that means suppose a and b are only consumer in the market then demand curve of a is an individual demand curve p1 p2 q1 q2 and demand curve of b is an individual demand curve of b p1 p2 q1 q2 a b now the market demand is a combination of a plus b when you add the demand for both the product you will get the market demand q2 this is how the market demand is arrived or we can say that it is a horizontal summation of individual demand curve that means when you add a plus b you will get market demand curve this is how we arrive and i hope you understood what is demand curve and individual demand and market demand thank you thanks for watching